but this is the Vatra 12.8 volt 460 amp hour beast mode battery. Welcome back to the channel. If you are new to the channel, my name is Anthony, and here we talk about being cool, living life, and doing stuff. And today we are talking about doing stuff. And I want to do stuff off grid. And uh, I have tried in the past uh, solar solutions because I love solar. Uh, I love the freedom that solar gives you. Freedom. See the freedom t shirt? Uh, but I love the freedom that solar gives you. And I've tried these little power stations like this EcoFlow. And uh, I'm going to do an update on this uh, on the channel because it doesn't last more than a year or two and then something goes wrong with it. The battery hasn't gone out, uh, but it'll cut off on its own. And it makes it a pain uh, just for doing little tasks like running a fan or just charging my kids' video games or things like that. So I am stepping up to uh, what you see here. Um, and I'm going to add solar to it later. I'll show you that. But this is the Vatra 12.8 volt, 460 amp hour beast mode battery uh, that I would like to show you. And I'm going to couple that with their 3000 uh, watt pure sine wave inverter. And then uh, the charger. I'm going to be able to charge this solar, but uh, if I get in a bind, I'll be able to run an extension cord. Uh, and or, you know, if you're traveling, you can use this charger uh, when you get somewhere that you have uh, grid tie voltage. You can use this uh, 120 volt uh, charger uh, to charge that battery up and this battery will last a lifetime. So let's get into it. All right, let's start things off by talking about this beast of a battery. And I mean, really, it is a beast. First of all, it weighs 95 ish pounds between 95 and 100 pounds. And so uh it's a beast in more than one way but look for big power uh that's where we are technologically wise uh to get that capacity and to have uh, any length of runtime on uh stuff that you really want to run you got to have a big battery and this is a big battery it's over 5800 watt hours of power uh all in this actually small unit for that amount of power and this is like having five 100 amp hour uh, batteries all combined in one little package or one little unit. Uh, that's how powerful this battery is. So for example, this thing can power your RV fridge for days on end. It'll handle uh, high output appliances like air conditioners and microwaves. And it's got a 300 amp BMS for top notch safety. That's gonna protect you against overcharging, over discharging and short circuits. Plus, check this out. Let me spin this towards you. This is the Bluetooth main switch. This thing connects up to an app. And the best thing I like about the app, because I'm old school, I don't want to have to sign up with my email and all that stuff and go through a bunch of prompts to get that app. I just want to get the app on the phone, be able to connect to the battery and see what it's doing. And Vatra hit it out of the park with that. They allow you to do just that. Check out this console. So as you can see on here, it allows you to monitor everything about the battery, the individual cells. It even has temperature protection. It's not going to allow you to charge this battery too hot or too cold. And so it's going to protect the battery at all costs and it lets you monitor that. It lets you monitor how fast it's charging, how long until it's going to be charged. And it lets you monitor basically all the health of your battery so that say you're in your RV or you're in your overlanding vehicle or you're in your off-grid cabin and you're up in the bunk. You're going to be able to just pick up your phone, look at it, and see the state of your battery uh, and the charge that's being put on it or if it needs to be charged. And so it's a really uh, simple, functional app, and I appreciate that, Vatcher. I really appreciate it. Now, if you say, well, hey, it's not going to let me charge it in cold climates, guess what? I have a surprise for you. It has a self-heating function down to negative 4 degrees Fahrenheit that it's going to heat this battery and allow this battery to actually accept the charge in a safe manner. And you know what, that is uh, cooler, or really hotter. Uh, <laughs> it's really cool, uh, really hot. Yeah, anyway, you get what I'm saying. It's a great function for the battery that you don't have to worry about not being able to charge your battery when it's freezing outside and you're freezing inside and all you wanna do is uh, maybe run a little heater off of this battery. So again, this battery capacity, uh, coupled with the ease of use and 
uh, coupled with the fact right from your phone on a very simple app where you can monitor voltage, current, temperature, and cycle life right from your phone. Man, this battery really uh, hits it out of the park. I'm going to keep you posted in future videos on how it actually goes uh, and how uh, the battery is, but using it so far just in testing, uh, I like it a lot. All right, so up next, look, I'm going to pair this with a 3,000 watt pure sine wave inverter from the same company, Vatra. And this thing puts out uh, a super pure sine wave, making it ideal for personal electronics like laptops or gaming consoles or anything else that you want to run uh, off of this battery and this inverter. And the digital display shows real-time power output and voltage. And the build quality, so far as I can tell right now, is rock solid. I plan to pair this with this battery, and I will use the charger sparingly because I'm going to pair it also with solar. And I'm going to hook that all up actually to an off-grid cabin outside. I'm going to show you that in a future video where we're going to run some stuff. Uh, it's going to be a workout room slash uh, goat milking parlor where my wife plans. Uh, she's already milking the goats, but she plans to need uh, a small window unit, which she's already using off of an extension cord. And then uh, a pump uh, for actually milking the goats with. And then some lights uh, and a fan. And we want to be able to run all that off-grid style uh, off of this battery and uh, this inverter. And then, if necessary, charging the battery uh, with that charger. And that's the last thing I'll talk about. I've already used this charger. I'm going to show you some footage right here. But as you can see, man, uh, that charger, it is super fast. Uh, it is also built like a tank. And it charges this battery up in no time, get you back to full power running. So this is uh, my setup that I am replacing uh, stuff like this because it didn't last very long and I'm not happy. Uh, even though they're a little bit more modular, they need to be able to hold up because when you're trying to do stuff off grid, you actually want to be able to do things and you want that system to last, especially when you spend a lot of money on it. Uh, so Vatra, this is uh, the system that I'm going to use. Again, I'm going to keep you posted in a future video. As always, I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Be cool, live life, and above all things, get out there and do stuff. God bless you and yours.